Thank you, President. I would like to begin by thanking Mrs. Carvalho for the excellent work she's presented today and indeed for the way in which she went about her business very democratically, not just here in the Parliament but outside. She was uh, deserving of the applause she received. Now, the FP7 is the biggest research program in the world and the proposal for simplification for the Commission is therefore very welcome. And the proposal come for, that's come forward from the Parliament really augments the Commission proposal. We say that simplification isn't enough. We say that we need a clear distinction between innovation and research. And it helps as well because it also picks up on areas of research and innovation that require uh, democracy, equal opportunities, that require transparency and we also th say that we want less red tape, less bureaucratic control and more focus on research excellence. We also recognise the various different areas of science when it comes to selecting partners and also guaranteeing equal opportunities. So to conclude, let me say that this proposal would really help to deliver better working conditions for researchers in Europe, but it will also give greater dignity and give, greater, give real improvement to research in Europe. So we should really back this objective. Big applause. Thank you.